Good morning. I just wanted to jump on the camera and say some stuff real quick. Not that I even have anything to say, but you know, it can be done. And if you do have something good to say, man, do it, man, say it because you just don't know who it's going to affect it. And you could be preventing people suffering, man, for real. Like, I think it's all for a purpose. I remember I used to do these uh, Facebook Live videos, and I just get on there and, and say whatever the fuck I was feeling or thinking. You know, people would react to it. Some people would tell me it's good or whatever, but um, I personally thought, like, I was a fucking idiot, you know what I mean? I'd do a live video, I'm like, this is how I feel in the moment, and then I'd watch that shit, like, two hours later, I'm like, what the fuck is wrong with me? This shit is embarrassing as fuck, you, you know, but if you have something to say, man, say it, man. I'm the type, like, I don't really mind getting on and, and saying something. But then a lot of times I feel like I don't really have relevant things to say. Or there's just no reason for it. And who the fuck am I to get on here and, and tell somebody anything at all? You know, so I, one thing I just try to speak from my own experience. Not my opinions and not my feelings. But, like, experiences and understandings that I have of my own my own self, like I'm not going to get on here and tell people how they should live their fucking life or something like that. I can get on here and tell them though how I've lived my life and what my experiences were and the results of it. You know, it's like um, when I was in AA, we share our experience, strength and hope. And I think that the more that I... I did that, you know, that's when I started to develop these concepts further and understand them like, like the whole fact of only speaking from my experience. Cause I, I would get on there and I'd say some shit from my opinion. And that's the shit that I'd be embarrassed about the most because I would immediately learn a fucking lesson from it. You know what I mean? It just works. God works in mysterious ways or the universe functions from equal equal and opposite reactions you know i'd get on there and say some shit and then immediately fucking go out in life and learn that lesson and be corrected you know so but the more you do it it gets easier and you get these guidelines and stuff or i did you know but um so and that's something that I want to do. I mean, I want to be, you know, of service to people. And I obviously don't mind talking too much shit and learning those hard lessons. But honestly, it's easier to learn the lessons this way from talking to people and reflecting on it rather than holding all those stupid ass opinions in and then living that fucking life of banging my head against the wall thinking that I know some shit. You know what I mean? It's a catalyst for, for education. <clears throat> Maybe if I share something, you know what I mean? It could inspire somebody else or, or uh, motivate them, give them the air and opportunity to do their own thing. Or... Uh, Maybe somebody will reach out to me and teach me something or, you know, maybe the universe will hand me that that development right there that I'm lacking because I've exposed myself that I'm lacking it. You know what I mean? But for what it's worth, just want to say do it like I'm not finna judge you. Well, yeah, yeah, I might I might a little bit, but I'm not finna hold that shit against you. <laughs> I'm like, what the fuck is this dude talking about? Oh, well, man. Well, you know, we just, come on, man. At a certain point, if those people are going to, like, really judge you and hold that shit against you for the rest of your life, and it's something that you, is going to change the dynamic of your relationship, fuck those motherfuckers, man. Straight up. Straight up. But what you do is you fucking correct yourself, you humble yourself, 
and admit that shit. If you were wrong, just admit that shit. Like, whoa. Yeah, I had to kind of pump my brakes and bust a bitch right here in the middle of the street because um, I was wrong. I've done that shit so many times in my life. I'm only 30 years old, you know what I mean? But being able to admit that I was wrong so many times, I think that um, I've grew. I've grown so much from that. So, I actually think this video right here is probably not too bad. The shit that I used to do on Facebook was fucking stupid, though. Um, but I'll tell you what, I grew from that shit. I would be sick. I would, I'd do the video, then I'd, I'd post it like, oh, yeah, this shit's hot. And then um, I'd come across it like six hours later, and I'm like, what the fuck? Shame, shame, shame. And God forbid I come... Oh, my God. The other day I got on this the old computer, man. On the uh, backup hard drive. And I was looking at some shit I had posted from like a year, two years ago. Oh, my fucking God. So embarrassing, man. Like, I really used to be like that. That's still a part of me, man. But enjoy it, man. Dude, for real, we, we live this life. We don't know, you know, how long we're going to live. If what the fuck comes after this, we don't know, man. Experience that shit, man. Put yourself out there. You just go ahead and do it, man. Do it. Do it. Do it. Do it. Don't be a bitch, bro. Post that shit. Let's go.